Well, as we've unfortunately seen, a majority of the deaths in Rhode Island from COVID-19 are tied to nursing homes. Iowa News News reporter Brittany Schaefer spoke to a local man whose father is among those who have sadly passed away, along with someone who cared for him at the nursing home. David Gonzalez tells me his father was brought to the hospital on Friday. He tells me as he was trying to video call him, the doctor told him his father had passed away. David Gonzalez found out his 76 year old father tested positive for COVID-19 on Thursday and tells me by Saturday he was already gone. Saturday, my father already had passed away. How does this happen? Norman Gonzalez was a resident at the Orchard View Manor Nursing Home in East Providence. We know from the Department of Health at least five residents have died there related to coronavirus. Gonzalez tells me his dad was his best friend. It's always good with my dad because we sit for hours and talk. Our father meant everything to us. It devastated me. My dad's a very strong man. You know, my dad was my superman. My Paul Ryana is a certified nursing assistant at Orchard View Manor and took care of Norman. He tells me the past few weeks have been tough. Norman was my favorite resident. I took very good care of Norman. I love Norman with all my heart, but um, it's very hard to go through something like that, but we're doing everything we can for these residents. Ryana tells me he's been working long hours because some of his coworkers are now sick. He says nursing homes in Rhode Island need help. We all got nervous for our residents mainly, but um, a lot of staff members also were nervous too because we weren't ready for the pandemic. We had PPE, but we still don't have enough PPE. Moments ago, we received a statement from a spokesperson for Orchard View Manor. They say in part they continue doing all they can to protect residents and staff and that they have asked the state for staffing assistance as a number of their health care workers are in self-quarantine after testing positive.